Hello comrades, it is about time that joint security area 2 is done. Today I am going to explore what they have changed and what is new. I hope it's worth the wait. But before I get started, let me just say something. Thank you Viking Law for making the game unplayable. Because of this, I am going to make a video just to punish you. Let's go to the video. So before recording I noticed that when you press the shift button you get the camera on a different angle. And you can aim but you can't go in first person which sucks. Also, I noticed that you can go inside the blue houses unlike in the last game. I do not know what purpose do they serve but whatever. And oh god what is this what have I become why did I disappear? Whatever. Time to check on where we definitely don't discuss stuff with the enemy. And hey, a comrade noticed me. I'm just going to say that I am recording because I can. Now time to discuss something. Never mind talking to these people is boring. Oh wait where are you going recruit? You are not allowed and I wonder how did they go through without even opening the door. Wait how is he still alive even with zero health is he hacking? Ah oh, never mind I will find something else to look at. And oh god what the frick is this? Why did you devs add this in the game oh god I'm not sleeping for the rest of my life after I finish this video. And here are the statues that the devs announced in the discord pictures. They look glorious. Oh no the moss are coming. I must pay respect to that statue or I am I am big trouble but I can't remember where is the salute key. I really cannot remember things properly anyways. Phew, they didn't notice me. After I looked at those boring statues I decided to go back to the border and oh look. A private on the ground crying cause he can't enter the building as his rank is too low. I feel bad for him. What is surprising is that Moss is going to become joint security areas TFOC. As you can see they are asking their ox if they are AFK or not just like how in military simulator where you are asked to stay in posts. I thought getting rocks in their posts is enough. Time to do a little trolling. Ah the new shop GUI is very new. It's a shame that we don't get our old guns back because I owned an RPD and a KAR-98K. Oh well. Thank you Viking Lore again. I just noticed that we are going to go to war very soon so I decided to buy myself an AKM to shoot the south guy for no reason cause to practice my aim. And before when I recorded this video I saw a feature that has been added. Cars are now accessible to the glorious north. Please hurry up and drive us there oh god what is taking you so long is it not that simple to drive a car by using your keyboard. Ah screw it you are wasting my time now I will drive this thing on my and I realized that those cars are not even working and no wonder why they took too long to drive us there. Thank you devs for wasting my time so much that I had to reset to go there fast. I was testing out this shift lock things to see if it's good at combat and I right. Now I am going to fight them without the shift lock thing because it is clear that the feature clearly sucks and I died again. Because this was this too long I decided to speed up this video to prevent you from getting bored. And we lost the war. Oh my god why is it so hard to enter this door what are the devs even thinking at this point please just for the love of god let me enter the building so that I can discuss things finally I got in why did that take me so long. And that meeting turned out to be pointless because I kindly shot at their faces and kindly turned my back at them. Do you have anything to say about that? Oh well, this meeting is boring anyways just like every meetings in this game. Time to do something else. And now you can go on top of the building and that moss wants me to go over the line but okay and oh what the frick why did I get teleported back here? You freaking tricked me on crossing that line even though it's your job to be the one with the brain while you can't remember the rules yourself. But hey, a good way to end this video after all the suffering and misery I had to endure just to make this video is by looking at this beautiful wedge of SOF people. Thank you comrades for watching this video. Please hit that subscribe button and turn on the notifications bell so that you won't miss any new videos. Also I am glad to announce that Blocks War 3 has released a new mission. Go play it now.